Today's video is going to be on emergency lighting. I'm sure most of us are prepared for um, large disruptions, disasters, uh, civil unrest, who knows. But I also like to prepare for the smaller everyday emergencies, like say a power outage. Um, one of the ways I do this, and one of the tools that I use, are these little lights. Now these are power failure lights. They look like regular night lights. They plug into your wall. And you know, you can see I got the light on there. I'm gonna pan the camera up to plug it in. And, and turn off the light. Let's see how horrible that looks with this camera. Ah, not too bad, all right. So you can see I'm plugging it in, okay? Now when I plug it in and it has power, it'll go off. I gotta do this differently. There we go, okay. There, as you can tell, when it has power to the outlet, it'll stay off. Um, when the power goes out, it immediately turns on. You can buy these in all sorts of configurations. This one is actually a light sensing one. So if the power goes out in the daytime and it's light enough where you don't need it, it actually conserves itself. It also has a flashlight. So in the event that you want to unplug it from the wall and use it as a flashlight, you can do that. Now, I mean, it's not an exceptionally bright flashlight, but it gives you something to work with. The last thing, and these are available pretty much anywhere. You can get these at Walmart, CVS, uh, Walgreens, any hardware store. They're power failure lights. Most of you are familiar with the ones you'll see uh, in um, industrial situations where it's a big gray box up on the wall and um, it has two big spotlights on it. And when the power goes out, those go on. Same concept here, really. Um, these can also be taken off and used as a flashlight as well. Same concept here, really. They're just kind of a neat way. And what I do is I keep them from my hallway, my bedroom, my hallway, into the living room and into the kitchen. So if I need to get around in the morning and the power's out, I can see where I'm going or if it's dark out or whatever. It also gives you a way to let you know that the power is out. Um, you may be sleeping. It may be very late at night. All the lights are off anyway. You don't know the power's not on. But if you wake up in the middle of the night and you see one of those on, you then know something's not right. Now, another neat little trick I have here, and uh, being that we're coming up, gosh, less than 100 days now, Christmas. <laughs> Christmas season is coming. Um, I pick these up at the end of the Christmas season. These are little white LED tree lights powered by 3C batteries. Um, you just turn them on. You can string these up around, say, a shelf or whatever in your house during a power outage. These are very bright. Um, they consume little to no energy. I mean, I've had the batteries in here for probably two years. Um, you know, I check on them, but I don't change them out unless something's wrong with them. And um, they will give you enough ambient light to get around in your house. Uh, I discovered these, I bought them one year, and it was right after Christmas. And then in the middle of February, we had a, a two-day power outage out where I live. And uh, that was basically our light. And I think I went through one set of C batteries in two days, and they had already been used quite a bit. So anyway, there's lots of options for getting you some light when the power goes out. Um, these are great because... They give you instant light, instant information. My power is out. And um, you can pull them out of the wall and use them as flashlights. So if you don't keep a flashlight by your bed or if you're stumbling around and you drop it or you knock it over when you wake up, these are in the wall. You always know where they are. And this is just kind of another neat little uh, side thing that you know I have. Um, you can buy, I, I suggest to buy them in all white. I wouldn't buy the colored ones. Um, it's harder to see under colored light than under bright LEDs. And they can be, I guess this is about 10 feet of LED light, you know. They can be strung out or bunched up. You can even use them as a flashlight if you hold them like this. And it's kind of a handy little thing to think about now with Christmas coming. Um, I tend to buy these after the holiday season. I think those were like uh, $4 um, because that's when they're trying to dump everything. But hey, if you feel you need one before that, I think they were 6 bucks. So anyway, there's my little tips for some emergency lighting for your house. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to click like and subscribe and we'll see you all soon.